Uh, we're going to be talking about capital gains tax and properties and the new rules. So what do I need to do if I, if I sell a property? What's changed? Hi there. So there are new rules that apply to um, the disposal of UK residential property sales with effect from the 30th of June 2020. So the difference is, is that if you make a capital gain on a property sale after the 6th of April 2020, you will need to report this online, which is something you haven't had to do in the past. So the first period applies to gains from the 6th of April to the 30th of June 2020, and you've got up until the 31st of July to report your gain. And then thereafter, the gains will be reported every 30 days. Do all sales need reporting? No. So if you haven't got a capital gains tax liability, um, because maybe because of the availability of a relief, such as principal private property relief because it's your own home or where the gain is below your annual exemption, you wouldn't have to report it. But um, where there is a capital gain, you will. OK, so how do I actually do that in practice? So um, UK residents are going to be required to report their capital gains through a UK property account. Oh, now, this right. account can be created with HMRC. You're going to need a government gateway um, username and ID, which people, if you do self-assessment, you'll be familiar with because it's the same one that you'd use for that. Okay. And you will therefore report the gain using this. Um, as an agent, we can help you if you need any help with reporting that gain. And we can kind of calculate capital gains and we can manage it for you. One thing worth noting is that if you do complete a self-assessment tax return, the sale will also need to be cleared on that tax return. And then the HMRC will give you a credit for any tax already paid. You said about 30 days. So what happens if I miss that 30 day deadline? Well, if you miss it, there is there will be late filing penalties for transactions which are not reported within 30 calendar days. And then there will be interest charged if any of the tax um, remains unpaid. Um, I believe that HMRC have announced that they will not charge any late filing penalties for that first period for anything received late up until including the 31st of July 2020 to allow people to get used to the new system. OK, so this new system then will uh, do, I assume that my estate agent and my solicitor will be aware of it and they'll be telling me that I need to uh, make this, these returns. Um, they will be aware of it and they will be aware of the returns. What you can't rely on is them to make the return for you. So you can't rely on the fact that your solicitor will have done everything because they might not have done. They should make you aware of it. Um, if you're not sure, then just let, speak to speak to us and we can help you. Lovely. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you, Leona. Thank you.